today we're gonna cook Croatian mushroom goulash vegan vegetarian with three different kind of mushrooms I'm gonna introduce them later so this is the cut very simple okay today we are here in south of Taiwan Tainan uh, I'm going to help my friend and teach her how to make Croatian mushroom goulash it's a very special goulash that is cooked only in east part of Croatia called Slavonia region. It's an inland uh, towered, uh, towered uh, Hungary and uh, that area of course for seasoning we will use uh, lots of sweet paprika powder. So paprika powder is already here ready to be used for this goulash. Since we are in Taiwan we don't have wild mushrooms, we don't have uh, original mushrooms that I would use back home mm -hmm. uh, so I'm gonna use just like an international one that you can find probably in your supermarket back home whether you are in uh, in England or in the United States or anywhere so the first ones are champignons that you see the the bottom mushrooms how they call them or in French champignons this is how we cut it like so one piece three cuts you get four pieces out of it this is it we have around 200 grams you can see here so it's all washed, dried, and we're gonna use it. So we have three kind of mushrooms, and then the base for our goulash, of course, just like for any goulash, will be onion. So I use one that size onion, like medium sized onion, the whole. So we're gonna fry this onion first with. Uh, I usually use sunflower oil, but this time we're gonna use uh, virgin, extra virgin oil, olive oil. And then we're going to add a little bit of carrot for the sweetness. That's it. And then the rest will be just uh, herbs. So persil right here. Uh, bay leaves that comes from Croatia, from our garden in Croatia. Beautiful bay leaves. I actually have a bay leaf tree here in Taiwan that I managed to grow, but we're going to use dry bay leaves. It's fine. We're going to use a little bit of uh, flour when we fried onion. I will explain you what for. So it's a flour, we're going to use a few spoons, salt, pepper, black pepper, paprika powder. I may also add some chili powder as well. So step two, we're going to put this onion inside gently because the oil is already hot. So we're going to put this onion. The secret of a good goulash soup is a lot of onion. Don't be stingy with onion because onion is going to shrink in the size anywhere. So just make it thin. Garlic. So this, uh. we want this color. Not black, but like golden brown. Mm. Yeah, beautiful color. So yeah, onion should be like this. So let's see. Are, at this stage, onions are pretty good. We're going to make a little hole here in the middle. We're going to add maybe one spoon of olive oil. And then I'm going to toss this bread flour. Maybe I can show you how much. So let's say two spoons. One, two. Okay, that's, that's a little bit more, so I'm not going to go We don't want too much. And now I'm going to mix it. Okay, at this point, maybe this one. Once we add the water, it's not gonna burn. The onion is not gonna burn anymore. So, we can fry these mushrooms a little bit. We're gonna fry it a little bit more. And then I'm going to add the water, maybe one liter. Mm -hmm. So you have 500 grams of mushrooms and one liter of water. So it's going to be a uh, good for 560 people, I guess. Right. Alright, the water 
is coming in. That was step three. Step four, mm -hmm. we're going to add remaining mushrooms. So all the mushrooms inside. And the carrot as well. And now we're going to just boil it a little bit. So maybe one full spoon or even more. We're gonna add the bay leaves inside. We're gonna add parcel. Cover. We're gonna cover it. Cover it. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna cover it maybe two minutes, three minutes, three minutes. It's Chinese three minutes. Mm -hmm. Three minutes, we're going to cover it. Now, uh, three minutes has have passed, so let's see what's going on inside. Ta -da! Okay, it's oh, look at this. Oh. Oh. But now you can see that this goulash uh, looks plain, no color, no, it's a very, like, it smells good, it probably tastes very good, but there's no color inside. And so what we're going to do, we're going to turn magic. We're gonna put this uh, paprika powder. So mm -hmm. you will see. Usually, like people will go like, "Oh, paprika powder." No, paprika powder. One, <laughs> two, maybe even more. Okay. All right. Inside. Yeah. That's it. Right. So, so all goes inside. All goes inside, and you will see now the change in the color, change in the flavor, and everything. Ah. And the thickness, you see, it's immediately mm. more thick. Right. The mushroom brush is ready. This is the texture you can see. It's very thick and slightly spicy. There's yeah, herbs inside everything. We're gonna serve it with the French bread, salad, and uh, of course, the cornmeal. Serving. So the cornmeal. Oof, too much. Too much. 